here's the thing, Zach. They're, they're a better team than this, for sure. I think Pakistani fans would be right in saying we've really been let down by our team today. The team will say we've let ourselves down today. I think it's it's also to do with the with the history of the ground, right? Yeah. We've, we've been talking about, okay, it's going to be a high-scoring match, the wicket is going to be flat. And that also plays on your mind. So, you know, mm. when you're going into bat, you're not actually playing the conditions because yeah. today's conditions were different to what we've been talking about. Cloud cover you spoke Cloud about. Cloud cover well. also we spoke about. about and, and, and moisture, and eh? These terms and conditions always apply, I think, you know, when you play in England. Yeah. And that's something, uh, something everyone has to keep in mind. So, you have to assess the conditions and then plan your innings. You know, rather than just going by the statistics and the numbers on a, on a particular ground, how, how they've been. Uh, so, so that approach was was seen by Pakistan uh, batsmen, and once you lose a couple of wickets in in doing that, then you're always catching up with the game. Mm. Uh, once once Russell uh, showed the way that okay, bouncer is working, the wicket did offer extra bounce, and that's something which was uh, which was nicely used by all the, all the bowlers. And uh, it's too late, I think, for Pakistan right now in this match. You know, they yeah. won't have any chance because till the time ball is hard. You know, there will be this extra bounce, and with Wabria's uh, few shots, it was it was seen that you know wicket will uh, get easier to bat on. You know, once the ball, uh, that hardness of the ball is gone. Yeah. So that's something which uh, which Pakistan missed to understand and and just see off that phase because things things get easier in english conditions you know if, if the conditions are tough like this after 20 overs or around 20 over mark things will start to ease out and yep. that's where uh, that's where pakistan didn't have any batsmen to go there this is i think one of the lowest scores pakistan's ever had in the world cup i think, I think their second lowest yeah. i think it's their second lowest ever so really dismal performance and in fact oshin thomas just like we were saying right now andre russell started uh, the slide even he said after the game that it was andre russell who sort of bowled that length successfully and i just sort of copied him and bowled that length and i think that a lot of bowlers are now going to copy Andre Russell and O'Shane Thomas and bowl exactly the same length uh, at Pakistan. And see, see the matches that they have lined up now. See how many of the teams are equipped to bowl fast and short at them. England, yes they are. Australia. Australia are. Yeah, but if they lose England and Australia, they're already three matches down straight yes. away. Yes. So they'll have to they'll have to worry. Yeah. Uh, India, uh, that, I mean, India is going to bowl. India likes bowling at the toes more, but Shami can bowl like that. Yeah, Bumrah can. No, bowl Bumrah like can. Bumrah can bowl like that. Shami can bowl like that. New Zealand, of course, they have them. South Africa. So, look, you know, Rabada and Ngidi will bowl there. But look, they're not children. Yeah, they're not. They're, they're not going to come every day and start uh, and, and start doing that. They're much better players than that. That's why they're they're playing for their country. They're not every time the short ball. They're not going to be closing their eyes. Hmm. But they'll have to but find an answer. They'll have to find a way. Yeah. yeah. Find probably the way is just get out. What 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 is the way? Do, get out, out of the way, sir. Get out of the way. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but you can't keep getting out of the way all the time because everything will be short. Uh, yeah, but there's you're gonna get. See, you keep doing that. You're gonna get one over the head no ball per over at least because no bowler. Zach, you tell you no bowler can continuously bowl six balls at the shoulder. They can right? expect now teams and they need a free hit using this strategy. Yeah. So so they have to prepare and each one has to figure out their own way. Of, of of dealing with this kind of uh, bowling, you know, if, if someone is bowling that short to you, how are you going to find a way of of scoring runs? Yes, some people like to back away and then use that uh, pace of the ball to, to to score runs because in 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 one day format, you know, there are restrictions as well, you know, with yeah. with regard to field placement. So you can you can find a way of of negating this, you know, the, uh, which which they'll have to do it for sure, you know, if if they are not able to. Uh, be proactive with this kind of approach, then then they'll be behind in the tournament yeah. for sure.